34 people have been arrested in a large-scale illegal sports betting ring as investigators sought to put a dent in an alleged mafia-run sports betting enterprise that authorities said cashed in over $1 million in bets each week. Those arrested made a first appearance in State Superior Court in Hackensack this morning. Okay, Mr. First, do you understand you're here today for a first appearance, which is simply to advise you of the charges against you like the right side? Prosecutors said the ring was split into two bookmaking and money laundering operations, one led by reputed Genovese soldier John Blue DeFrosia, the other headed by family associate Thomas Conforti. Authorities said both men ran a large network of bookies. The investigation, dubbed Operation Strikeout, began in September 2008. Bergen County Prosecutor John Molinelli said bookies in the North Jersey area collected losses and paid winnings to the bettors. Codes were used on how bets would be called in, and then the individual package holders, uh, they would be the ones that would be responsible for either collecting the amount of losses over the course of a week for the bettors or paying out to the bettors who had won. You, you have bets for thirty, forty, fifty thousand dollars You have bets for 500 All of them are grouped together by each of the individual package holders, as we call them. They're all designed to make sure that no matter who wins, at the end of the week there's going to be a net positive cash flow. Uh, you know, you want to go down to Atlantic City, you want to go to Las Vegas, you want to go to Connecticut to gamble, uh, perfectly legal, uh, perfectly safe. This is the wrong type of gambling in layman's terms. This is the type of gambling that, if it goes the wrong way for you, can get you in a lot of trouble, uh, can actually expose you to some physical harm.